The day Harper was born was, was crazy. That was one of the most emotional days of my life. My wife, Hyla, she had basically a, an emergency C-section with a partial abruption. You know, you, your wife calls you, says she has some bleeding and, and has to go in the hospital. And I don't know, puts things in perspective really fast. Harper was in the NICU for right at three months. And going through that, it just gave me a very Hello. big perspective on how important this wing of the hospital is in a, in a moment where you're so vulnerable. This is Hannah. Hannah. The resiliency of the kids that are in there, and they go through so much, and they're hooked up to so many monitors and breathing tubes, and they've got all these beeping machines all over the place. Yes, hi, beautiful. Oh my goodness. It's an amazing thing that's going on there with these little, you know, one, two, three pound babies growing and overcoming such odds. You got a good team here. <laughs> yeah, she's gonna be a rock star, okay? I'll tell you one thing, the nurses, make the hospital go for me. They're so in tune with the families, how to talk to them, how to communicate the good and the bad. And I don't know where we would be without the nurses we had in the NICU uh, when, when that was going down with Harper. Harper just turned three in August and is doing great. I flip back through pictures and you just look around and see some amazing, amazing moments and make the, the experience so real and precious when you look back and everything's okay. It just, there's nothing better than that.